This is a land of living waters, a land of shimmering waters, a land of big blues, big blue skies and big blue expanses of water, the Indian River Lagoon and the Atlantic Ocean. Here on the Indian River Lagoon National Scenic Byway, the water dominates the landscape. As you drive along this 233 mile scenic byway, the water is never far from view. The Indian River Lagoon National Scenic Byway skirts along the water, crosses over the river and inlets, connects islands, and edges its way between the ocean and the lagoon along the narrow, flat barrier islands. This scenic byway has its own magic, where at times the land seems to float between the sky and the water, where you can have close encounters with manatee and dolphin right here in the lagoon, where you can spot our resident prehistoric looking alligators close up from the safety of your car. This place is so magical you just might see people walking on water. Well, not quite. But the shifting shallow sections of the Indian River Lagoon provide some interesting recreational opportunities. Two iconic American roadways form the major part of this byway, US-1 and A-1A. US-1 traces its way along the Indian River Lagoon on the Florida mainland. A-1A edges along the barrier islands between the lagoon and the Atlantic Ocean. Designated a National Scenic Byway, and part of Florida's scenic highway program, the roads loop around the Indian River Lagoon from Sebastian in Indian River County north to Merritt Island in Brevard County and edges into a portion of Volusia County. The byway includes a western loop through Fellsmere and the headwaters of the St. Johns River, an American Heritage River, and it includes a northern loop to Titusville and the Canaveral National Seashore. The roadway links a network of colorful beach towns, historic downtowns, and old as well as new Florida communities. This National Scenic Byway highlights history, nature, recreation, culture, exploration, and scenery. The Indian River Lagoon is one of the most unique bodies of water in the North American continent, being named an estuary of national significance and included in the National Estuary Program, noted for having a greater diversity of animal and plant species than anywhere else in North America. Over 4,000 species of plants and animals, manatees, dolphins, whales, alligators, massive sea turtles, a fisherman's paradise. Over 700 species of fish, over 75 rare threatened or endangered species. There's even an elephant refuge here. And birds, there are over 300 species of birds. 